Good evening, Christopher. So after those Watsonville PD officers bought Rudy his bike less than a week later, someone stole it from him. But luckily, he's got it back. We've got the whole story. Take a look. It's been an interesting week for Rudy Diaz and his new BMX bike. Let's start with how he got the bike. Diaz was in the market for a new bike to learn tricks, hence BMX, so he found a seller online. He was going to meet the seller in Watsonville when he came across three Watsonville policemen he knew from his neighborhood. I was passing by and then I told them that I was looking for a guy that was selling a BMX and then I just, they said that they, it's dangerous because it could be a stranger and they might take you in, in the house. So the officers took Rudy to a local bike shop instead. The kid came in with the cops and he liked the bike. He liked one of the bikes and the cops were like, hey man, we're getting you this. The kid just started crying and he was really happy. I got emotional and I was grateful. I hugged him because it was my dream bike that I wanted. That emotion carried over to his mother when she got the news that her son was gifted with a $500 BMX bike. My mom got started crying too because she said she couldn't afford me one because she had to pay bills and she works in the fields. A happy ending until Rudy's bike was stolen a few days later. But yes. that didn't feel good. No, it, it was just disappointing. Rudy reported it to Watsonville PD and soon the three officers surprised him again by recovering his BMX dream bike. I just want to say thank you for buying me the bike and I honestly thought poli policemen were bad, but not all of them are bad. I'm very grateful for what you did. Now, one of the reasons why uh, police were able to recover Rudy's bike so quickly within 24 hours was because he had it registered here at the department. Now, all you need to do that is to come here to the station, fill out a form, and then you need to have a photo of your bike and the serial number. Christopher. A great tip and good story. Thanks, Sierra.